My name is Abdullah Bukawa and I'm a bartender. My name is Chris Hewish and I'm a tattooer. My name's Christopher John Deakin, uh, I'm a musician. Hi, my name's Nick and I'm a chef. My name is Justin Robson, I'm a head of business affairs at Effective Records and a producer of electronic music. I'm Gavin Crossan, uh, Woodhouse Menswear Buyer. I'm Kevin Buck, I'm a sales agent. My name's Terry Farley, I'm a DJ. I'm Fabrice Limon, I'm the owner of Scotch Limon Brand Consultancy. Describe my style. I could see a teddy boy wearing something cool. I could see something like a hipster wearing something cool. And if I think it fits in with what I wear, I would wear it. My musical influence is just anything that's got a lot of soul, got a lot of guts. I guess to style wise, things like that, that's the same. The influences uh, with my tattoo is and have always been actually the people that I work with. Uh, my style, I've definitely picked up uh, influences along the way throughout my career. Very English. Tutorial. My influences originally came from being out and about in London in pubs and bars. People were influential people there at the time, how they dress, how they put things together. I just tend to sort of observe people going about, things that are functional, practical, and good looking, I, I sort of take I do like to dress up, I like long mats, I like um, smart Oxford shirts, people I see in Shoreditch on the street. I'm a big fan of Ivy League, late 50s, Americana early 60s mod style. I think the 50s were moving from wearing traditional suits to doing denim based things, nice clean white t-shirts with a, with a roll sleeve and a, a quiff. I really liked the 50s because it was the first time that Marvin Brando wears like a t-shirt and it's cool. I think now, I think you can uh, express yourself in so many different ways, so I think in terms of style era, I think this is the best era we've ever been. Woodhouse have always curated clear and concise way of dressing. I think the new collection looks great, it's very simple, it's very classic. Uh, there's some really key staple pieces in there which I think everyone needs in the wardrobe, Oxford shirts, um, bullet jumpers. Favourite, I would say the Oxford shirt because it's most versatile. The shirts are really nice, they're the perfect way. The Oxford shirt, I think everyone needs a clean, crisp, smart shirt in the wardrobe. You can dress them up, you can dress them down, you can wear trainers with them, you can wear shoes, you can wear ties, you can wear with jeans, you can wear these suits, chinos. My favourite item would be the fly fronted Mac. With the Mac, a little bit smarter, it's not heavily branded. It's well tailored, you know what I mean? The way the fabric and the way that it drapes is very, very nice. It's still got Woodhouse's signature on there. It also represents English manufacturing as well. Very Michael Caine, you know, in Alfie, that kind of look. High quality. But also you can dress that down quite easily with chinos or jeans. And the nice thing about the Mac is it works in both ways. I can wear it over suit, I can wear it with some smart trousers. You can see it's a well-made jacket. That's what I like about it. One of the Woodhouse key pieces, I would say, is the wax jacket. You know, it's so easy to wear. You can wear it to the match, walk the dog on a Sunday morning. The wax jacket's definitely changed over the years. It's a little bit smarter now with the slimmer fit. It's an everyday jacket for our Woodhouse customer. Accessible fashion, you know, like everyday work. The fact the collection's actually made in the UK means an awful lot to me. We've taken classics with a very simple style, giving it a contemporary twist, definitely with a Woodhouse signature, and that's to celebrate our 40th anniversary. And it's all made in the UK.